What's up, homies? This is your boy here, Big Deuce, right here. As you can see, we're over here at Papa Rick's house. Hey. What's going on, Rick? You got ice in it? No. Gotta have ice. You gotta have more than $30. $35. That's just for the oysters. You gotta have ice and keep it. Mike and his girl. Mm. What's going on with you, bro? Chill it, man. What kind of raggedy shit is this? Mm. Motherfucker, man. Come on now. Stop fucking around. Oh, look at this. Hey, Reporting live. You got in the bag. Okay, we can make up for that. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. You hear when you get back? What's going on, Mike? All right, let's take that ride. I got to free this. Knob a little bit more weird. Mm hmm. Got any kinks in there? What the fuck's wrong with this motherfucker? Turn the kinks in that hose? Oh. Um, yeah, there ain't no kink in this hose right here. No? No, no kink. What about the um, sprayer? No fucking chance. Gotta get a beer for the road. Hello. Hello. Here you go. So what do you really buy most? Losing a thousand bucks of my hard earned cash. What is this in the sun? Oh, I'm coming. I got to put this um, soda in the refrigerator. Yeah, we already know. Yeah, it's going to be a long day. Mm -hmm. Ah, when that dope for you. Oh, you got it. That's good, we did. Uh -huh. All right. Hopefully, this camera don't fall off. Tell me. <coughs> he got $70. You just pick up the orchard on the way. I'll give you the money when you get here. Yeah. And as you can see, he waits till he's on top of somebody before he tells you he's there, he's on the way, or he's close. Yeah. I didn't have a chance to give you the address or where to meet me or give me a heads up so I could meet you there. Yeah. <laughs>
going on with you? Just working, man. Working, working, working. Yeah, yeah, I wish I was still working, but shit, ever since um, the war with uh, Russia and Ukraine happened, you know. Huh? You messing with some Ukrainian? No, I worked with some of them. I was saying this is that when I was working and starting the fires, you know, because uh, things were being slow because of the war. Uh-huh. Where uh-huh. they had to cut back on the country, cut back on the meat. Which I was the oldest person that was there, even though I wasn't actually installing the appliances. Mm-hmm. But I was the like the helper. Mm-hmm. I was helping the install and get everything ready and everything hooked Little up. Little routine. Yeah, while he takes out the old. Hell yeah. Mainly dishwasher is what we work on. I hate a fucking dishwasher. <laughs> I got a dishwasher, you know what it turns into? A fucking cabinet. <laughs> I don't fucking use no goddamn dishwater. I, I, one person, yeah. why, I, why I need a dishwasher? Yeah. I'm not no motherfucking restaurant. I ain't feeding six people. Uh, ain't six plates I gotta wash. It's one plate. Yeah, exactly. I dirty one pan, I wash one pan. I dirty one plate, I wash one plate. Me too. The fucking dishwasher's obsolete. You wash this is better by hand anyway. <laughs> you know? I ain't saying that the dishwasher don't work, but they, they don't. Oh, they work and, they, and they're sanitary. I mean, they get hot. Yeah. So they kill germs, true enough, and they work, you know, to a certain extent. Mm-hmm. Of course, my experience really that I, when I used one is when they first started really coming out. Yeah. And they had them to where you could just you wheel them over to your sink. Yeah. And you pull the hose out like a like a washing machine hose. Yeah. And it and you had a special faucet so you could hook up to your sink. Yeah. And that was your water. That's how you got your water to your dishwasher. Which way? Uh, let's see. Let's take a ride. Take a ride. I think it might be best. We're we'll gonna take the old back way to instead of going up three twelve and all that mess that way. Okay. Hopefully the traffic's less this way. Across the old Matanzas River right here. Yeah. Right to the left. Uh, I mean to the right. You have all these fucking assholes that are lined up already. What the hell's the problem? <laughs> oh, it's a goddamn bridge. There's a guy. There's a boat going under the drawbridge, I'll bet you. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of, uh, it's east of Did y'all just come from that side? Oh, yeah. That bridge How the hell up. did y'all get all the way over here when you were supposed to be coming up 207? Joe was all screwed up. Y'all came 206 all the way from 207, didn't you? Oh, yeah. When he said we hadn't passed a little gas station yet, what gas station were y'all uh, talking about? Um... I think it was something about the one in Hastings. Oh my God! I could have met you at the fucking oyster place right there at the store. By the, I was talking about this little store yeah. by the oyster place. Yeah. It's called Wildwood. It's after you go under 95, you take 207 all the way. You don't turn on 206. Yeah. So. You got uh, he he probably don't even have Google navigation navigation on his phone. I don't know. Uh, my my phone is uh off. Uh, I'm using the phone now. You got navigation? If I had service on my phone, I have navigation, which I do got to have for it, but I got to have Wi Fi to be able to get on there. Nothing. So, my phone, even when I didn't have Wi Fi in my house, has yeah. an app for Google Maps. Yeah. I'm quite sure yours does too. Uh oh, uh oh, what was that? I thought I might have seen a portal for a minute, but that's it. They have one in my brother, at my son's house. Yeah. Corpus came in there, Dolphin came in there, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Matter of fact, I seen one in there not too long ago. And when that tide's high, it's, it's still only about five, six foot deep. But yeah. If you low tide, you'll see, because there ain't nothing but oyster beds right there. Oh, yeah, I see them. I see them all the time right here. The tide's so screwed up right now, it's messing up the oyster man over here because he's fishing yeah. strictly local. Yeah. And the tide, you got to have a four or five hour window to go get oysters. Mm-hmm. And the way it is right now, it's yeah. only like two hours. Yeah. The tide gets down, you got two hour window, you got to be off the river, I think uh, two o'clock. Uh, so you can only, but they go out and they just get, you know, they just, whatever beds they see that's got good oysters, they get them. Yeah. And that man sells sometimes 100 bushels, 150 bushels a week. Yeah. Times 65. Uh, 
pretty good living. Oh yeah. They hold the family that that gets the oysters over here. Yeah. Oh, man. Uh -huh. His family goes all the way, way, way back when there was nothing here. Yeah. There wasn't no beach houses. There was, I mean, there was a couple of little roads. Yeah. And on that A1A right there, they had a Maryland fried chicken right there at Crescent Beach. Mm -hmm. They had Jack's Barbecue down the way. They had yeah. cowboys on the river, seafood. Yeah. That was a big draw. People from Black and all over the place would come over there uh -huh. to that. It's on, it's on the river, it's on the marsh, yeah. marshy side of the river. Yeah. <clears throat> but man, it's got some good seafood. I wouldn't doubt it, man. But anyway, his family's moved here from wherever. Yeah. And basically just squatted on the land. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. You just pick your spot and make it, that's yours, you know what I mean? Yeah. And they made a living off of that river mm -hmm. their whole life and became fairly well. He's got a storage right there. He sells his oysters oh, right okay. there. And all that land right there is his. Yeah. And there's hell, there's a damn road up there. Got his last name, Covet's Road. Oh, that's cool. The Covet is there. They're old St. Augustine family. Oh, that's what's up, yeah. It's good. These people right here we're going to right now, yeah. they intermarried with each other, the prices and the Covet's. Uh -huh. So he's got his, Mr. Price had his over here. This guy says, well, hell, I'm going to do it over here. Yeah. And he did. And he did well. That's good, man. It's, um, Florida got um, some history, especially the places out here in Florida, like the small towns and the uh, small, like, uh, Middle class cities, man. It's the state of Florida, man. It's got some history. Man, some real, real history. Behind. Good swimming holes and good, good country folks, really. Oh, Most, yeah. for the most part. Uh, some of the stuff to do, like as long as you like riding the boats and, and swimming and. Yeah. And, 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 and the other day, this is thing I seen on there. I said, uh, "What's the most alligator-infested lake in Florida?" And they said, well, number one lake for the most gators is Okeechobee. Oh. And you know how big it is. Oh. It's huge. Oh, I wouldn't doubt it. Well, I there's another one that's, yeah. that, that's got more yeah. per, per acre. Uh -huh. So it's a lot smaller lake down in Oviedo. Uh -huh. It's called Lake Jessup. Yeah. How many, it's a good sized lake. How many gators do you think's in there? Um, I think it's um, about, how about, um, boy, about 50 gators in there? 30,000. Nah. And 900, anywhere from 900 to 950 of them are yeah. 14 foot. Yeah. Or, or what was it? 10, no, 10 foot plus. Uh, a thousand, and, and the next question was, is it safe to swim there? I, I wouldn't. I, yeah, I know. All them gators in there, the hell, no. Yeah. <laughs> if you want to swap, take person, it right. Okay. If you oh. right lane slide. If you come want, on, come yeah. on. Watch out now. Yeah. Knocked over my daggum TV. <laughs> oh, watch out! You know, I goddamn got a kill. These yeah, fucking people ain't treating us right. <laughs> take it right, yeah. Hey, come on, take it right now. Right, I mean now, not now. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. See, we serve just license and registration. Huh? <laughs> you got license registration, I said. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys, with the camera. <laughs> yeah, but you know what the funny thing is? There's 30,000 gators in Lake Jessup. Yeah. But there's never been a reported alligator attacking a human death. Yeah. That's that's crazy though, which it, which I which I'm pretty sure it's been a lot of, but it ain't never been reported. Man, I'm telling you something. That's a lot. You go I'd love to just get a boat one night, like a pontoon boat, so you're pretty well off the water. Gators ain't really getting time up uh, aboard, you know. Yeah. Because down there. Uh, my silver glitter.